Where have you been? Getting wine. It's my week. No, it's my week to bring the wine. You texted me earlier to tell me to I get wine. I did not. I said it was my week I for the wine. I went way out of my room. No, go put it back. No, put put your wine. Go you, throw you, it back. You, you're done. Karen's macaroni and cheese is the only thing that makes your presence bearable. Funny, because Ted's tiramisu is one of the few things that helps me forget the times that we were actually together. Uh, hey! hey. Yeah. How's the world's perfect couple? It's, it's great. great. Just like Fine. even better, better than great. that. Yeah. So. I brought some red. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> So, Karen tells me you guys climbed a mountain last weekend? Wow. Uh, yeah, uh, last Sunday. Oh, oh, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Mount Corner. Corner. I thought you said it was Mount Greylock. Uh, oh. Nope. Um, that mountain was closed uh, uh, due to v vandals, the, uh, v mountain mm -hmm. vandalism. All over. Well, regardless, I think it's great that you guys can get away together. Sounds like something Karen and I could use. Ted, hey, can you bring the bread in here? A mountain? Listen, she called on Tuesday. I had to tell her something. If you're gonna make something up, at least let me know before we get here. Okay, we got through it. Can you smell that gruyere? Can't you just taste those macaronis? We just need to make it through dessert. We can do this. I can do this. The sparrow had the most Let's go eat. That he launched from the branch and he found himself falling. No, even when he's away, all he sees is the forest floor. And he don't trust the air to hold him anymore. Oh, what do you do when you can't? I am stuffed that macaroni. Wow, but Ted, don't worry. Still got room for your legendary towering tiramisu. Well, actually, about the dessert, we wanted... What's the dealio with the water in this place? You only got two hours worth of hot water? We're out of hot water. Thank you, Uncle Hank. But now really actually isn't I the best... I found this wine in the elevator. Wine is cheaper, am I right? Hank. You know Friday nights are our nights to have guests over. So go back to your room. All right, Teddy boy. I'll go. But somebody's been eating my cookies. Karen, you said he would be here for two weeks at most. It has been half a year. He's my uncle. What do you want me to do, throw him out on the street? So what was that you guys were saying about the dessert? Karen, just go ahead and tell them. We wanted to let you guys know that we won't be having these dinners anymore because Ted and I are separating. Oh no. I'm so sorry. Yeah, yeah it's just, it's been a crazy week and I didn't have a chance to make the tiramisu. What? No dessert? Yes, no dessert. <laughs> uh... Call me old fashioned, but I was raised that after a good meal comes dessert. Yeah. Nick, Karen and I are separating. So what's that mean for next Friday? No more Fridays. <laughs> we'll be able to see both of you separately like for coffee. Do you know the lengths that we go to for these dinners? She actually can't even stand the sight of me. It's true, I think he's hideous. Her presence gives me dry heat. Ugh, and the tone of his voice is like a Bagpipe being drawn and quartered. We've been broken up for four months now. 
But every Friday night we put on our fake smiles and do our little romantic song and dance just so we can come over here and actually feel satisfied. And now you're telling me this is our last Friday meal? And you don't even provide a dessert. Well, I didn't see that coming. Yeah, I thought they would have known better. Hey. It was really cool, what you did in there. Yeah? Yeah. 